Would you like to have real joy in your life, not mere pleasure or good times? As we move into the season of joy to the world, it's important to understand that joy isn't to be found in purchases, gifts, chocolates, or even a trouble-free life. Some of the most exquisite moments of joy come in troubled times. How is this possible? Today's encouragement from the Father comes from Hebrews 12:2, which says that Jesus is the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross. Christ's joy in saving, healing, and loving us, and the fullness of joy we have in him and with him, gave Jesus the power to endure the greatest agony anyone has ever suffered. Jesus models that having joy isn't about our circumstances. It's about our focus. Russell M. Nelson taught joy is powerful, and focusing on joy brings God's power into our lives. Pray for God's joy. Look for it. In all of creation, Jesus planted gateways to joy. Look for him in the clouds, the sunsets, the birds, light rays on the water, the tiniest flower, a baby smile, and the breeze on your face. Shift your focus away from difficult circumstances and look to Christ and his tender mercies all around you. This joy is the power to endure the Gethsemanes and crosses of our lives.